Hey guys, Taylor Brown here with String Theory. In this episode, I'll be exploring how to make uneven tiles and blender cycles. So let's delete the default lamp and camera and the cube. We'll just be adding a plane for this tutorial. So add a mesh plane, scaled up by something like three. And then let's copy the plane here. Shift D, move it up and give it an emission. Set the strength to something like 10. Render it out. Let's use cycles and the GPU. And then let's get into the shader editor. Right here. Click new. And then let's add a brick texture. With the node ringer installed, we can press Control shift left click to view each node. And you can see the add-on right here. Let's press Control t to add a texture setup. Control t and then use the UV. Okay. Let's match the row width to the row height. So 0.25. And these are offset right now by 0.5. So let's change that back to zero. So now the tiles. Now let's change the mortar size to something like 0.005. That's much better. Now, if you want to have an uneven mortar size, what we can do is get a Texture, any texture, it can be a noise texture. Let's get mixed RGB and two value nodes to define the limits of the size. Let's do 0.0. It's oh, so a 0.01 for the maximum size and 0.001 for the minimum size and plug the texture into the factor and the color into the size. Now, we don't really see that fact too much. So what we can do is increase the scale. And now you can start to see that effect working in here. Let's add some detail here. And then let's add a color ramp and just bring this in. Okay. Now let's plug this into a noise textures vector. And mix this with the object coordinate. And we can see that each tile is getting its own separate noise texture. The white and black values and the gray in between are, is offsetting the noise texture to each tile. Let's change the scale to something like two. And then let's plug this into a bump. Now we can see that the mortar is coming up off the tile and we don't want that. We only want it impressed into the floor. So what we can do is get a mixed RGB then just copy this brick texture and plug the vector into the vector and match the same mortar size here. And we will change the colors to all the way to white. And this just creates the factor for where we want the noise texture showing up. 
let's plug the color into the socket here. And we can see we only get the noise texture showing up on the tiles and not on the mortar. Let's plug this into the height. Let's just change this color to a black. Now it is going down. Let's plug this normal into the normal socket here. And then let's lower the roughness. Change the color to black or something. Then we can always get a third brick texture. To define the color. White for the mortar. Then black and dark gray for the tiles here. Then we can always lower the strength. And change the scale here. And change the factor for this mix RGB. And that's how you do it, guys. That's how you create uneven tiles in the window cycle.